Let's -a go. Are you guys ready for this week? Are you guys truly ready? Can you guys really handle the greatness? Which I'm gonna deliver to the table right now to all you people. Oh shit, and the camera just started to... Oh my god. Camera, I hate you so much right now. There we go. Are you guys truly ready to experience the greatness? The one and only Misitoshi Sensei Sama Kun. Are we ready to finally get in to some motherfucking we go greatness this week John Cena style do, 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 bam, man or go yeah also uh, the Nintendo Direct is also today as well so I'm also really hyped for that it, it, it sucks there's no one piece this week but whatever though um, of course Oda has to take you know his little breaks oh man oh man oh man not again. Yeah, Oda is on that break stats again. But luckily, we got Toriko Greatness to hold us down at least. And Bleach, I'm starting to sort of liking it now again. You know, with the whole uh, Kyaku's Monk guy. I didn't read that yet, but I'm going to read that like a bit later on. But anyways, it's time for Toriko right now. So the chapter title is 347, The Tested Knight. Ooh. Could it have to do anything with Don Slime? You know, on the manga stream cover, I see the picture of, like, Ichiru. Does this mean this is the chapter where he's finally going to be revived? Already? Hmm. Alright, well, let's dive into it. Okay. <clears throat> little text in the quarter. A meeting between big shots concerning the fate of the Earth. What is the key to holding back this impenetrable, uh, impenetrable doom? <coughs> Even now. Okay, this is the... The boss of the whole back channel. Even now, who seems poised and ready to revive. Uh, there's still one more thing. Hmm? Then, what, then we got the hurry. I still can't find it anywhere. Ichiru's spirit. <laughs> what? Wait, I see Don Slyon's face. It's like, what? Like, okay, so this is what it really means. Okay. For a second, I thought we were already going to get him revived in the actual chapter. But no, it's just a little cover page shot of... The test at night, and then we see we felt the taste of that tea as one that day, or oh, unless it's a flashback that I'm thinking of, a flashback within a flashback, but I highly doubt it. Um. <clears throat> anyway, oh hoo hoo, I'm gonna be sucked in. Oh no, poor Chin Chin. Oh shit, no. Oh my god, my boy, no. We need more food. Keep it coming and don't stop. Y yes, sir. Ugh. My stemma, it, it's being drained. Even though all I'm doing is stirring it, it's wearing me out that valley. So this is what it means to cook God. And this is only one tiny portion of a fragment of God. Um, <clears throat> Yo, Mog's face is shook. Yo, Mog, yo. Mog's face is completely shook. Just what the hell kind of ingredient is the king of ingredients God anyways? That's what I want to freaking know. Oh, Yakuza, yeah, oh, my, oh, Yakuza, yeah, that, that's what you say. <laughs> Ren's like, you could do it, Yakuza, do it for the people of the sun. Yakuza, Yakuza, he's our man. If he can do it, no one can. <laughs> oh, dead ass, are you serious? He's like, quit chilling, get your ass over here and help me. Wow, damn, Mark. Damn. <laughs> he's like, yeah, you know, exactly, Ren, come on, girl. You're supposed to be the future wifey of Toriko, you got this. No way, I've got to prepare myself for when my... i got to prepare myself for my wedding with Toriko. Yeah, guess how many fucks I give? <laughs> wow, Mock, damn. Kind of being an asshole there for a bit. It's a little bit harsh. And Kamatsu, like, I don't see Chaco anywhere. We stopped the sacrificing of people, so he should still be alive. I hope he's just been put to work somewhere. Mm -hmm. What? Your? Yep. Yeah. Bitch, we guessed it. Bitch, we guessed it. Whew! We were right. So this is obviously Chaco's mom. So yeah, we all guessed it. It is Chaco's mom. You're Chaco's mom. I yes. Although this body is someone else's. Wait, someone else's? Wait, what the hell? Okay, I'm kind of intrigued now. What do you mean by that? It was half a year ago. I was forced into labor and my life was taken to be used as fertilizer. You, you you were killed? 
But in the soul, and that's come on to. But now she says, but in the soul world, any, anyhow, I was able to make a name for myself with my cooking skill. And just recently, I was allowed to be resurrected into a new body. My eyes haven't fully adjusted. Yet. Oh, okay, so that explains why her eyes are a little off there. Like they seem lifeless. Which okay, that makes sense. My eyes haven't fully adjusted yet, so I, so I still can't see very well. But I was blind in my previous life anyway. So oh, so she was blind either way in her previous life. Ah, oh, okay, all right. So this is, I guess, sort of making sense. Okay then. Um, I can sense a lot. But it doesn't bother me too much. I can sense a lot just from smell. <coughs> is is Chaco? Is he all right? Yes, somehow. Ugh, Kamatsu's like that's a relief. And he's like Chaco was looking for his mom. Er, I mean, I think he came here looking for you, Chef Kamatsu. And she says you were the one that was to get up with Chaco back in the city, weren't you? A smell Chaco sent on you, and a familiar and a familiar nostalgia scent of home. The one who came here and masterly prepared air was you as well, wasn't it, Chef Kamatsu? Having just met you, I've, uh, wow, damn, this woman's praising Kamatsu, like, yeah, all bow down, the king of kings, Kamatsu, the chef of, of prophecy, man, oh my god, having just met you, I ashamed to have to do this, but Chef Kamatsu, I beg of you, please grant me this favor, Kamatsu's like, foot favor, there's no time, she says, while I still have my memories of my life, and my memories of Chaco, okay, Wait, what the hell? Wait, what? Three days have passed since the departure of Amuru and the Gourmet Knights. Okay, so it was three days away. Oh, wait a minute. Does this mean we're gonna skip the shit with, like, fucking, like, Atlantis and all that? Oh, no. Are we really skipping this? Dead ass? Dead ass, we're skipping this too? Oh, my God. So it's been three days since. Wait, are you fucking kidding me? Are we really skipping this too with the whole underwater shit? No! I wanna skip it! No! You can't do this shit to me! Oh, what the hell? Alright. I wonder if we're gonna be able to see the material. Oh, here's a uh, linear sky. I wonder if we're gonna be able to get the materials we need to make the golden cookware. Uh, for now, all we can do is rely on their food luck. Okay. Everyone. Oh, it's Sysia um, Pumpkin. How you figure something out? And she says, yes, I figured out the flow of time for each of the seven beasts. But that's where we've got a problem. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's right. I remember in that one chapter when we were going back to Area 6. She was trying to figure out the difference between time. The difference between, like, different timelines. You know, between the underwater, uh, the underwater city and shit. Oh, wow. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. I ate a little bit before I, I began this, so... <laughs> Problem? And before they all left, Chef Gigi said that the manufacturing work was supposed to be simply... Was supposed to be simple. That's what I do to say. And she says, the work is simple. Our problem lies with time. And you know what tomorrow is like? Time? Dot, dot, dot. Three days ago. Southwestern Shore. So we're getting a flashback within the... In a flashback, within a flashback, yo, what, what the hell? Some Leonardo DiCaprio shit, yo, what the fuck is going on here? All right, these are all campy monsters. They were all originally scraps cut from the Seven Bees, but they've been tamed over by Don Slime. Yo, Don Slime gave them the works. They're like, yo, listen up, you're working for the Don now, man. You fuck up, it's back to the fucking ocean for you, man. Like. <laughs> Fuck your shit, man. Fuck your shit, man. Yo, this is crazy. All right. Apparently, we can't use board. We can't. We can use board. Board them. We can use board them, and use them to uh, acquire the materials for the golden cookware. That's a weird way of saying it, but okay. If I and then it's like, um, oh, oh, he's like, if I recall back when we first entered the. Oh, Santamaru. Okay, he's like, if I recall back when we first entered this country. A piece of the Corleum chased after us then as well. It's incredible that Dawn has a ba a, a, able to tame all these things. Okay, so it's a possibility. Now it makes sense now. So Dawn can actually tame all these like different beasts that are coming up to, you know, that are pretty much intense and stuff like that. So that explains, I guess, the coral thing with the, uh, the freaking 
the the cloth and shit. I'm assuming that's the case. <clears throat> and then Jesus says, we board these camping monsters. We should be able to get close to the seven beasts without them noticing us at all. And he's like, if we can get right up close to the buddy seven beasts. Excuse me. Oh my god. Then gathering these materials doesn't sound so hard after all. And considering the method of gathering them to just to pull them out, as long as we follow the rule of one person pulling continuously with all their might, it should all go according to plan. Yep. All that's left are your rations. Uh, are your rations. Okay, here we go. Oh, shit. This here, six days work. Do your best to make it last somehow. And said tomorrow is like, all right. For us, making it through an entire week, we would not even require rations, so we shall be fine. But three days have already passed by now, which means... Doesn't that mean there's only three more days until they finish with the production, right? No, you're wrong. The total production time of six days refers to the time on the outside. The outside? The seven beasts are all back chan- Yo, they're all back channels. Oh my god. Yo. All these seven beasts are fucking back channels. Oh my shit. Alright. I'm trying to let that seek in, but what the hell? Holy god. Oh, give me a gal, sorry. Just coffee, I'm sorry. Alright. Their flow of time is different. For example, right now for the country we are all in, the flow of time is about one sixtieth of the outside world. One sixtieth? Then that means yes. Or, or to put it the other way, time moves 60 times faster on the outside compared to here. What passes as one minute here is one second in the outside world. Ho 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 ho, and Gigi's like, that's correct. Very precise from Gigi. Uh, Chef Gigi, uh, so six days time on the surface, with this country's time speed being 60 to 1. That makes 360 days. What? That's nearly a year. Extracting the golden materials takes a full year. You're still wrong. Ugh. Wait, what? He's still wrong? Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean he's still wrong? Wait, I don't get it. What the fuck? Still wrong. That would be in the case of Giant Shell. But the flow of time and the other seven beasts are... How long is it towards the other seven beasts, then? If that's, like, one. What the fuck? Ten times that. Yo, Atlantis. Yo, Atlantis. Yo, Atlantis. Alright, I'm hyped now. Holy shit, damn. Atlantis is packing right now. So how long will it be if they answer Atlantis? That's crazy. Ten times that. Oh, no, this is not Atlantis. I'm sorry. Excuse me. Pandora. Oh, that's right. This dude. Turtle King Pandora, Super Giant Fox with capture level 4,800 a turn. Oh my god. Oh shit. 4,810. 4, oh my god. If three days have already passed as a present here in this country, then for. Oh my god. Damn! Holy shit, this thing's carrying a fucking land of a castle of a kingdom on his back. Yo, that's crazy. Holy shit. In three days, I've already passed as a present here in this country. Yo, set tomorrow and them, yo. Oh, they're fucking getting like, tired now. Then for them, they would have felt the flow of time as ten times that. In other words, 30 days equals one month. Oh, shit. Damn. So he can already tell. Damn! Shit, he's already feeling it, yo. He's not really feeling it, man. He's not shulk. Oh, my God, yo. Fucking, oh, my God. It's tomorrow. Oh, my God. No. This dude, I don't know if he can survive, man. Chef Gigi, why didn't you tell this to the gourmet knights? Ho, ho, ho. I just wanted to see the result. Result? We truly have... Wait, resolve? Really? We truly have no idea when we'll finish this cooking we're doing. It's an outrageous production process that can easily overwhelm it with no end in sight. So I wanted to test the resolve by not telling them when and where their goals were. Okay. Let me ask guys like, but for this ingredient to need each of them completely alone, for 10 years time, pulling with all their might without stopping or to extract it, that's surely not something any normal level of resolve can handle. 
I think you're misunderstanding. Oh, Gigi's like, oh no, young one. You, you, you underestimate me, man. It's because it's just 10 years that I didn't want to tell them. I think it's who you, I think it's you who misunderstands. You shouldn't underestimate the gourmet knights, even if it, even if it were to take centuries. They're not the type to start tapping out over something, something like that. Excuse me. Oh ho ho! Well, this is promising indeed. Oh no, no, as a question, okay. Uh, uh, uh by the way, will Har will Harimaru son and the others all age ten years then? Mm hmm. No, 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 no. You all came from the surface, so you'll still age at the same speed as you would your body. Will just feel as though ten years have passed, though the stress could age them though. Whoa. Okay then. So wow. So even if it's felt, yo, this is some hyperbolic time chamber shit right here. Wow. Yeah, this is definitely DBZ levels here. Like when it comes to that. Uh, yeah, this is definitely like now we're we're we're, we're seeing what, what's going on. Now. Okay, so this is definitely reminds me of DBZ. Whole like a year's worth of time or training, whatever, can feel like it's even though you're the same age, your body will feel the effects of like it being like it's past so many years. Oh my, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Underground depths of the Eternal Kitchen. Royal Femist. Don Slime's copy room? Don Slime's copy room. Oh my god, yo. Alright, this is like, this is like, this is like, okay. What is it, what is it, what is it, what is it? Oh, oh my god. What is, wait, are they doing what I think they're doing? Oh shit, yo. Oh, this my boy. Ichirayu, yes, there he is, naked and all, and where the hell is his penis, I'm just saying, like, what the fuck, did they cut his penis off or something, like, unless they didn't make it, maybe that's, oh, maybe that's why he looks pretty more younger, oh, okay, I get it now, they're making a copy like his soul and spirit, they're making him the younger Ichirayu, oh, man, oh, shit, damn, yo, that's gonna be crazy, oh, my god, okay, so there's the copy room, and now they're actually going to... Oh, man. Yo, this is crazy. And what the hell? Like, the man still has no dick. What the hell is going on? All right, this is the last page. Ichirayu. Where, oh, where has your spirit gone? We've already created a copy of your body. Come back to us. <coughs> Come back to us. Come. Let us once again share a meal together. Aww. Look at John Slime. He's like, oh, he really wants him to come back. Hmm. The sorrowful spirit searches for is now deceased, former half of himself. Okay then, so. All right, so that's the chapter. Oh wait, a little thing at the bottom. Hold on. There is a man he wants to revive. Next chapter. What do these two have to do with each other? Oh man, okay. So that being said, all right. So that's the chapter of uh, of uh, El Torico. Okay, so we got a lot of information regarding. Um, <clears throat> we've got a lot of dialogue heavy stuff, uh, and it was actually really interesting. It, it was actually a pretty interesting chapter of Torico. The explanation of what we got of the back channels and how once they go into each of these beasts, it will take like the time they get there is pretty much like a, a several years or whatever. It takes about like a year or two. Well, it takes so all in total, does it really take 10 years to cook to actually get the golden materials? Will it actually take them 10 years? That's something we don't really know. And this whole mystery with Komatsu, we don't know. What she's gonna ask, uh, has to do with Chaco, but we don't know. So they're in, you know, uh, fucking Pandora. No, not Pandora Radio, bitches. Fucking Pandora Turtle. Oh my god, the thing is ridiculously huge. Oh my god. The building itself looks pretty cool. And, uh, uh, they're making a copy of. And the ending, though, was like, you know, man, I, I got the feels for Don now, man. He really wants Ichirayu back. But, you know, unless they can't bring him back for some reason. So they gotta find his spirit. 
that's the only problem. They say his spirit is lost, so that's the reason why they're also having trouble of him getting revived as well, is because his spirit is lost. And not to mention that they still need all to cook another. They still, it will take them over like five, six, seven, eight years, etc. By the time they're in that state. And once they do that, it'll feel like it passed. But it will feel like it's gotten them much more stronger as individuals. It'll make them like a billion times stronger. Like on some hyperbolic time chamber shit, man. Yo, that's pretty freaking crazy. So we got to know a lot more about those back channels. So, that's crazy as hell. So, they're not going to age. So, yeah, definitely, definitely DBZ syndrome right there. Oh, my God, yeah. All right, so that's the chapter. Um, Pretty good chapter. I like the explanations. We got a lot of memory dump, and I mean a lot of memory dump in this chapter. But it was still worthy information, so, I mean, not really too much hype greatness going on. But I'm going to give this one a 4 out of 5, or maybe, I was going to give it a little lower, because basically it's just an, ex, it was an okay, just explanation chapter, but, this was actually really worth it, because we got a billion, um, we got a lot, we got a lot of, um, a lot of hype, we got, uh, not a lot of hype, but like, a lot of great information revolving these back channels, and reviving these, these seven beasts, actually, yeah, the seven beasts, so that was really good, so I'm going to give it like a good rating, yeah, it was a good chapter, so, four out of five i give the chapter a four out of five pretty damn good chapter of Toriko. not great not fantastic not greatness not epic sauce john cena level but still pretty damn good chapter let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below of this week's chapter of toriko ikidakimasu misatoshi san thank you so much for another uh pretty much for a good explanation chapter i really liked it about the good work but still greatness hopefully the greatness will come back the hype the, the greatness hype will come back probably in the next few chapters or so when we get to like all the beasts and the materials and stuff but regardless though if you're not a big fan of all this information i don't know you may or may not like this chapter but regardless though so pretty damn good stuff all right so i'm sending out guys stay tuned next week for chapter 348 live reaction slash review this is the ninja reviewer over now to the bounce piece out anime manga fans keep supporting what you read and what you watch ikitakimasu bitches signing out see you next week guys for 348